at Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, May 31, 2023, Lawrence Hard shares updates on Middle East deals. Hard reaffirmed his stance that Mullen Advanced Energy Operations will sign multi billion dollar deals in the Middle East. Lawrence Harge held a live stream to discuss multi-billion dollar contracts in the Middle East. Harge also sought to separate himself from Mullen Automotive's core business, stating that he only talks for Mullen Advanced Energy Operations. In addition, Harge disclosed that he owns zero shares of Mullen stock. It has been over a month since Mullen Advanced Energy Operations Senior Vice President of Technology Lawrence Harge teased a $10 billion contract with Saudi Arabia that was already agreed upon. However, there has been no official confirmation of the news from either Mullen Advanced Energy Operations, Mullen Automotive, NASDAQ MULN, or Global EV Technology. As a reminder, Mullen owns a 51% stake in Mullen Advanced Energy Operations, while Global EV and EV Technology LLC own the remaining 49%. Harj had previously hosted a live stream discussing the $10 billion contract with Saudi Arabia. He also noted that the country would pay for a manufacturing plant in Michigan. Let's get into the details of Harge's latest live stream. Lawrence Harge shares updates on Middle East deals. First and foremost, Mullen Automotive and I, we have a tentative agreement. We are working out the final details of our agreement, which is very positive. And at that point, when we complete that hopefully it'll be this week we will be making major announcements, said Harge on his recent Facebook live stream. This news was welcome for Mullen stock investors, as they have been patiently waiting for official word of the deal. Harge went on to explain that he wants to distance himself from Mullen's core business. One of the things I wanted in my agreement is, the newly formed subsidiary that we formed, I want to be separate from Mullen. Whatever business that Mullen conducts, that's Mullen's business. I don't get into Mullen's business. I'm focused on the subsidiary that Mullen and I share 51 to 49%. Harge further distanced himself from Mullen by explaining that he owns zero shares of Mullen stock and has no intention of buying shares. Meanwhile, shareholders were primarily interested in the potential deal with the Middle East. Harge explained. Are there deals in the Middle East? Absolutely yes. There's about three deals in the Middle East. There's a couple of deals coming from other parts of the world. This is tentative. We already committed. The deals are committed so nobody can back out. Harge's use of the word tentative has left shareholders somewhat confused, as that implies the deal is uncertain. However, Harge went on to say that there are several upcoming deals in the Middle East as well as Asia. So there you have it. Several multi-billion dollar deals coming out of the Middle East, some that's coming out of Asia. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.